I'm on latte before anything. <sighs> Welcome back. So today we're going to jump right in to what we have bought for the house. For those of you who know, I feel a sneeze coming. <laughs> but for those of you who know, we are building a house. We are around about 12 weeks off moving in and I bought a whole bunch of stuff and I posted it up on Instagram the other day and um, I got a lot of questions about it and um, I just wanted to share with you where I got things from, what my ideas are for them and then in the future um, we can watch all those things come to life in the house when I make videos about me decorating and stuff like that. So first I want to start with one of the um, cutest items is this pot. So this pot I just got from Kmart, um, it literally cost me like $13.95 and it is like solid like cement. Um, so I'm just going to probably pop that in maybe like a bedroom, maybe the lounge room, like I'm not sure yet, but we'll find a place for it when we move in. So for anyone wondering, that one is from Kmart, it is called the Terrazzo Pot with Legs. That would be the wrong way, but that's what it's called. Um, so if you wanted to get one of those, $30.95 at Kmart, which I love. I do not mind anything as long as it's a bargain. So that was that one. I bought three of these little jars and my ideas for them are for the cotton buds in the bathroom. So we currently have one in our bathroom at the moment that we use that has the cotton stems in it. So I want to use these ones for that and then maybe like some cotton balls. Like I'm not too sure yet, but I think that would look really cute in the bathroom. So I bought those. They were also from Kmart. Um, I did keep the receipt. Oh my gosh, look at that. Okay, so the pot was actually only $13 um, and then the these little things were $4 each so whoa I nearly dropped it um, well worth it in my opinion then I got this cute like natural look tea towels I just think that they will go really nice in the kitchen they're like not you know too out there they're just nice and homey and just beigey colors so to me like that is a win they're just cotton tea towels and um these were three dollars believe it or not just for those so again bargain I got this box. So anyone who's into organizing as much as I am will appreciate this. This is just a um, oil burner box. So you can just store your oils in here. And I just reckon it's really nice. Um, you can leave it out. You can put it in a cupboard. Like it's nice to just have a place to have all your oils organized. I can't even speak. I am sleep deprived so bear with me I have not slept properly in the week but um, that's beside the point um, I thought this was really cute and I think it was only like $10 I'll just confirm that yeah $10 so for something that's going to organize your oils and make your home look aesthetically pleasing I was sold on that idea this one is my fave so this one I got to pop in the bathroom with some magnesium salts in them. I'm going to buy like a little wooden spoon and just have it on top so that we can just sprinkle magnesium salts into the bath when we want to have a bath. Um, so that's my idea for the bathroom. This is, was like $4. You cannot go wrong for that. Like look at how cute that is. Yes, there's like a little problem here with like the glue. But I'm just going to get like some super glue and just glue it back on. But like for how cheap it is, really like you can sacrifice some super glue. It's, yeah, it's fine. We're all about that here. <laughs> um, these are so cute. So these are like freezer bags. So with these we will um, like make smoothie bags or 
chop up like some fresh produce that we want to freeze like onions um broccoli cauliflower like anything like that and we'll just freeze them in here and then they're reusable so you just wash them out and um reuse them so they're like pretty deep inside which is nice so i love those i've got two packets of those and I bought this really cute bowl. It has like a cross on the bottom and then that's like the top. So I said to Michael, like when we have our buffet in our bedroom, like I might put this like on the buffet and we can like sit our keys on there or like whatever, I'll do something like that with that. So I think that would be really nice. Um, and again, it was only like $10. So for a little decorative item that's like that natural neutrals that will be like a timeless piece in your house I highly recommend love that and then I got this basket which I just think is so cute like it's it's pretty like small but I just think you could put like some rolled up um like they're not towels throws throws in here and pop it in like the spare bedroom where like if people get cold they can go over and like take one or if you have like an event um, you can pop it outside with some throws in there or you could, yeah, there's so many things you could do with this, like have it in the laundry, like a laundry basket. So I love this. I was like, yeah. And I've already got like two baskets similar to this one that, um, I do use for my laundry. So it wouldn't look ridiculous if that was a path I ended up choosing. Copy break. Almond lattes. Amazing. I bought five packets of these because anyone who knows me knows that I love organizing so when my pantry is ready I will most definitely be like spending a lot of time organizing it and I think these are really nice containers to have and you can like top them up with all different things you can wash them like I don't know I just I'm obsessed so I'll just pull out like one so you can see like a, a rough sizing so that is how they look you have them in all different sizes obviously like so like this one I would use for pasta this I'd probably use for like a little snack like M&Ms or something and then these ones like crackers and then I don't know like a flower or something like that but I bought five packs so we can really Play with that when we move in i love the clip top up here and then you just like take it out and you put your stuff in but it suctions on like really well so it's super airtight love that they're so cute i cannot wait to put these in my house so cute so next up this is a big ordeal for me because like okay I can spend money but I don't like to do it like I would if I see something that's cheaper like I'm obviously gonna go for that option this one has a bit of a backstory so we are, so do these actually like I've gone to buy these online for like 50 bucks for like five not gonna happen this was $20 for a pack so I got five of those um where was I right so I had my cart full of like bedding to put in the new house and I don't want to even say it but the cart was like $800 and I was like I just left it in there I wasn't going to jump into buying it because I'm like $800 on bedding like that's excessive Jen like let's think about this so I did I like was like I'll just do some research like see if I can find anything similar so basically I jumped on to Target's website to look at something totally unrelated and these popped up and they were 40% off and I was like these are $40 for bed sheets like why on earth am I going to pay $800 when these were 40 so without further Ado, I will show you. 
So first up we have the Arlo Stonewash Quilt Cover Set. Guys, look at this. It is so cute. So that is the set that I bought. I think this one cost me like $40 for the set. So um, it also had these like attached to the page and these are like $10 each, I think. So I also got two European pillowcases so that when I make the bed up, I can have these two and then like this and then like have it set up like spare bedroom or even our bedroom. I just thought it was really cute. And then to go with this, I found this cute little candle. This was $8 guys, this candle, $8. I would go to Glass House and spend like $100 on a candle. No, $8. And is that not aesthetically pleasing? Like look at how they match. It's a girl's dream come true. So, and it smells, it's freesia and cherry blossom. And it was literally just like a Target wear candle for $8. It smells so delicious. So like, even if you just have the lid off and like sit it on top, it still looks like super cute with the lid on. Doesn't matter, like we will style the room together when the time comes anyway. But I just wanted to share this with you because it's so pretty, so pretty. When I pick something like this, just know like it's, not my inner stylist coming out it's some random lady i don't even know who she is like just going like yeah this is a great idea but we'll see how it pans out in the new house this one is the raya velvet quilt cover set what do you think like it's nice it's soft but like what do you think i don't know I don't know how I feel about it. Again, I got the European pillowcases. I'm gonna open one because I really want to see what the like frilly edges look like. It comes in like a cute little pocket. I love keeping these little pockets because I, I feel so put together when I have these pockets like in the cupboard and I can go and I'm like yeah this pillowcase goes in like in this pocket I just feel so bougie so that's the frilly bits that are on it and it's like a velvety it has like two sides I feel like you could reverse the oh no you couldn't because that like not velvety but that is like what the Texture is my nails need painting. I know. I think it's super cute. Anyway, we will figure out if that is going to be a great nail house. But we will go through all of this stuff together. So yeah, I just wanted to jump on and and do a little like video on what I'd already bought. Things I'm planning to buy is like towels, um, a few more decorative items, some planters, some like picture frames um but at the same time i don't want to step on anyone's toes like if we have a housewarming party and people buy me gifts like of course i want to put my gifts up in the house so i'm like limited in what i should and shouldn't be buying but regardless like it's exciting so i'm just gonna keep buying little bits and pieces like here and there and then yeah we'll see how things go from there but um yeah thanks for watching guys um i really appreciate all the support um michael and i are really trying to like bring more videos to life and just share our journey with you guys and we know so many people are on this journey we love like collaborating and sharing ideas and just talking to people who are going through similar things um so yeah super exciting so please subscribe give this video a thumbs up um there's going to be a lot more coming your way so especially when the house is built we're going to be doing a lot of organizing a lot of um meal prep like all those kind of fun videos and hopefully i will be a lot more present like at that time so without further ado thank you for watching and i really hope that you guys enjoy bye